Hello, hello. So it's Adam, aka Dad A with Addison. Hey, girl. Hey. Hey, what's up, girl? Oh, hey. Hey. How you doing? Oh. Are you playing with a toy? And Everest. Queenie. Queenie. Bam, bam. Anyways, so we never did a uh, day three final update on the girls' potty training. Yeah. The third day we had them in the Little Learners training pants from Kanga Care. And after the third day, we came to the conclusion that they weren't ready, which is totally fine. And we weren't stressing out about it. We weren't disappointed. We weren't frustrated or mad or anything like that. Uh, we were just listening to the girls and and they aren't ready and that's totally fine. The girls definitely showed signs of the signs of when to start potty training. So they showed some of those signs. So that's why we made the initial decision, decision to start potty training the girls. Eric and I are happy that we introduced it to them, even if it was quite early, uh, just because they have the idea and they are continuously kind of like going to the toilet and saying like pee pee poopy type of thing so they are getting the concept and i'm happy that we introduced it to them now so when we reintroduce it to them later uh whether that's in a few weeks a month a few months uh i think they're gonna get it like that hopefully i'm not covering up the microphone with my hand wow uh yeah so hopefully they get it really quickly, which I think they will because this first go around they did pretty well with it being completely new to them. So yeah, so that's the update and <laughs> Everest, what are you doing with that toy? Are you hiding your toys? You're hiding your toys down to your shirt. Addison, what you doing? Yeah, that is the uh, results of our potty training diaries part one. Because I guess now there's going to be a part two when we revisit it. So, yeah, but uh, we're keeping busy here. The girls have had a few sniffles and runny noses. But other than that, they've been good. Ooh, and I have uh, five songs. Ah. Hello. 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 I have five songs to finish in four months. So here we go. But I'm gearing up to release the first McEwen album. Uh, but I'm so excited about it. Oh my gosh. It's, uh, oh my gosh. The, the album's amazing, TBH. Like it's definitely the best body of work I've ever done. Uh, but it's gonna have Neon and Love That About You and A&E, um, which were the three songs that I released from it thus far. Um, there's going to be a couple others, I think, that might have already been out there. And then like 10 brand, brand new songs. One of which is the new intro. Oh my gosh, and that's one of my favorites. Okay, so wish me luck. I'm going to probably document the rest of the album making journey uh, over the next few months. So fingers crossed that I get the album done because I want to release it at a very specific time so we shall see but i'm sure the girls are going to help me and all that and i think i see toys flying behind me goodness sakes <sighs> yeah oh and on top of making the album i have i think six songs to choreograph for the chorus that i'm in which i'm really excited about so i'm gonna go in though i want like a real amazing show so like chair dance routine and oh it, yeah it's gonna be awesome so i'm gonna be a busy little bee outside of being a stay-at-home dad yeah oh yeah you want to shake your booty <laughs> good job addison oh, oh yeah that booty oh uh, what's in what's in your pot do you have some food are you gonna feed me some dinner Oh my gosh, so we don't have to make you dinner? Oh, wow, you're having plastic triangles. 
That's amazing. Whoa, it just shot out of there. It's incredible. All right, so I'm gonna go focus on giving them some food because I don't know if magnetic plastic triangles are a well-balanced meal for them, so. <laughs> yeah. Also, if you're not following us on Instagram, definitely go over there and see some of our recent posts because we've been posting some really cute photos and videos. There was one of Eric and Everest like dancing together to the ABC song. Oh, cuteness overload is like well alive and kicking. Anyways, subscribe if you aren't yet. Give us a thumbs up. Uh, oh, and give us a thumbs up if you think I can finish this album in time because... <laughs> Any positive encouragement's gonna be great for me because we got our work cut out for us. We'll see y'all soon. Three.